today have a favorite story? Do you have a favorite book or a favorite movie? Does anybody? Oh, I saw. Oh. Favorite everything. Oh, you do? Yeah. Do you want to tell us the name of one of those things? Um, I like. The Squid Squadron books. Oh, those are good ones. Yeah. When? what's a favorite story of yours or movie? Um, Jurassic World Dominion. <laughs> That's good, Eden. Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes. I love it. How about you? Horses. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, you know what? We love stories so much. Uh, one reason why is because we can learn so much about the world, and we can learn a lot about other people through stories. You know, every week in church, we listen to part of a story. Do you know where we hear our story from? Ez, what do you think? Bible. That's right, the Bible. That's right. That is the Bible. The Bible is a collection of stories and writings written over thousands of years by different people in different languages and different parts of the world. People told and wrote stories or letters or poems and songs of how they experienced God. Groups of people collected these writings and put them together. That's what we call our scriptures. When we read and study the Bible, the Spirit can speak to us and help us under God, understand God and ourselves more and more. Well, today is a special day. Today, our second graders are going to receive their very own Bible. So if you are a second grader here today, we invite you to stand up for just a little bit. On behalf of Ottawa Presbyterian Church, we present these Bibles to you. As second graders, we believe that you are old enough to read these words on your own, to study them, pray, and to understand God. But you do not do these things alone. You do them together in a context of community of faith, our congregation, and your Sunday school teachers. All right, All right I'm going to come on over to Miss Beth. As you grow, we hope that you will bring your faith, bring your questions, and bring your doubts. We commit to you to love you, to support you, to listen to you, and to learn with you. Together, we will grow in faith and knowledge. As you read God's word as part of this congregation, our community of faith, you also read it and learn it as part of your own family. Parents of second graders, if you are here today, we invite you to rise in body or in spirit at this time. As you grow, we promise to read these words with you, to listen to your questions, to share your ideas, and to be honest about our doubts. Together, we will grow in faith and knowledge. You may be seated. When you hear your name, we want you to come and receive your Bible and then stand up right here in the front until all your friends have joined. Okay? You may hear some names this day of folks who are not with us in this place, but we're going to name them aloud anyway in celebration and in prayer for them. All right. Let's see. Avery Armstrong. Annie Buckner. Wynn Busby. Huddy Cannon, Rose Doherty, Eliza Elliott, Taylor Futhi, 
Caroline Gitman. Ez Hinson. Mary Hill. Hattie Logan. Dylan Mulqueen. Liam Mutchler. Sydney Parker. Myers Pontius. Anna Blair West. And Henley Woodruff. got everybody? Does everybody have their Bible? Yeah. Okay. Very good. All right, y'all. If everybody can look over here, this is our prayer for you, that this day you would receive the word of God, that you would learn its stories and study its words. For in its stories, we understand that they, those stories, they belong to us and that these words, they are our words. They tell us who we are. They tell us that we belong to one another and that we are part of the people of God. We receive these Bibles with our hands and our hearts and our minds. We want to grow with you in faith and knowledge. By the power of the Holy Spirit, may you encounter this story as God's living word for you and for this community, and for the whole world. And all God's people stay together. Amen. Amen. All right. Y'all, can we join in a prayer together? Can we say the Lord's Prayer together? Okay, very good. Let's pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. All right, y'all. So now that you have received your Bibles and everyone is ready, those who are in third uh, threes through kindergarten are dismissed to worship and wonder with Miss Suzanne. Where is Miss Suzanne? Yeah. Y'all can follow Miss Suzanne to worship and wonder. <laughs>